I've heard a lot of mixed things about it, not just brush specifically, but brushes in general like this, like hair blowing, uh, hair blowing brush, hair, hair, hair brush, blow dryer, hair blush, bro, oh my God. So you can become a part of the Icy Gang, yes. Okay, as you guys can probably already tell, you guys can probably already see today we are doing something with my hair because otherwise, why would I be walking up on this video camera looking like this? Why? Like I just walked out the shower. Um, so I just washed my hair not too long ago looking like a hot mess okay so we are testing out this Revlon hairbrush blow dryer thingy yes I'm so excited um if you know me if you know my hair like I don't take the best care of my hair even though it's flourishing it's doing what it needs to do but the one thing I dread is detangling my hair I hate it so much hate it with the capital T Yes, I know it doesn't start with the T, but there's a T in hate, okay? Hate is a strong word, but yeah, I do not look forward to detangling my hair, getting it done, blah, blah, blah. So I'm about to put my hair in locks um, just so I can not do anything to my hair for a while. Um, but yeah, I just washed my hair, so we're about to blow dry and we're going to test out this brush. I've seen... I've heard a lot of mixed things about it, not just brush specifically, but brushes in general like this, like hair blowing, uh, hair blowing brush, hair, hair, hair brush, blow dryer, hair blush, bro, oh my God. You guys get the point, you know what I'm talking about. I've heard a lot of mixed things about this. I've heard people say that, you know, it's like, does it work on natural hair, blah, 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 blah. But we're about to find out right now because I have the naturalist of natural hairs that you can have. Do you see this? Yes, this 4B, 4C, Z, D, E, F, G hair. We're about to try this out, okay? So um, I'm just gonna jump right into it and we're gonna try this out right now because we don't have no time to waste. So let me put this in. Come on. Oh. <laughs> I was doing it the wrong way. Okay, so it's plugged in. I guess this is where like I section my hair off is that what these natural hair gurus do. Okay, we have a whatever tie, hair tie. So I'm gonna section my hair off, kind of not really. Um, so we're gonna take it in sections. So I think I'm gonna start off with the back first and I'm gonna try to tie up the front. So first I'm gonna undo what I just did. I'm gonna moisturize my hair first. Um, I know you should be using heat protective, all that good stuff. This moisturizer, we're gonna do what we can with this and this is gonna protect my hair, okay? Um, so this is what I have, Liv. Um, maybe many of you know what this is. I did not discover it until recently. Please don't take my black card away, please. Um, so my hairdresser, hairstylist, the person that did my hair the last time because I'll be going to different people. She's the one that recommended this to me. So it's like a conditioner, grease, so we're gonna, want, we're gonna moisturize this hair because it's looking a little bit dry right now, okay? I mean, we want it to be dry, um, but let's moisturize it. I like the way it feels. It's different, it gives me lotion vibes. I feel like I'm lotioning my hair. Okay, now we're gonna turn this bad boy on if I can figure that out. Okay, so it has a few options here. I don't know if you guys can see. So it says off, cool, low, and high. So I'm gonna start off with high. I 
already i feel like i already really like this like that was really quick that was really quick do you see that i mean it's not i mean it's doing what needs to be done like look at it giving me blowout vibes already i mean obviously it's not flat 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 and i can tell at the end my hair might be a little bit puffy but ugh, look at that i i'm feeling this but let's try to get through a few more and then we gonna really decide if this is the key or we gotta trash this impatient so as you guys can see you know i started off with these small sections but i'm gonna try to grab a little bit more so i can speed up the process and see if it still does what it needs to do but i'm really a fan of this because i don't know like my mom she used to have like those blow dries that had like the comb at the end but the comb was would always come off because of how you know thick my hair is like the comb would get lost in my hair my mom got to find it like where you at but i really really like this you know, you don't have to think about holding, combing it and then blow drying it, doing that separately or fighting with the um, blow dryers that have the comb at the end and then they go missing. Like, I don't know. I'm really feeling this right now. I don't know. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below. crunch but i'm just trying to get this over and done with so i'm gonna take a larger section and see how that goes so we're gonna do i just discovered something for the first time in my life. First time, first time. I heat damaged my hair. Yep, I did that. Look, look, I never knew what heat damage was until now. Do you see this piece? Do you see this piece right here? Do you see how straight that is? Oh my God, is this what heat damage is? Do you see that? Do you see my curls right here? And do you see this? That's crazy. Oh my god, I don't even put heat on my hair like that, but the last style I had was a quick weave um, with the leave out. This was a part of the leave out, but like, oh my god, what do I do? Do I like cut it off? Oh my god, I have to call my sister now because I think she went through this too. That's crazy. This is what heat damage is, right? <sighs> okay, so we're going to try to do the rest.
I did the back. Um, now I'm gonna go ahead and do the front. So, just so you guys see, this is what, ha what we've done so far. I know for sure, like if I took my time, I could have done a better job, but like I told you guys, I'm very impatient when it comes to my hair. So um, maybe if I, you know, left it in the smaller sections, it would have probably been a little bit better, uh, but I am liking the results so far. Okay, time for the front. look so my camera cut off mid me finishing this front side part um but this is what we have here the revlon brush dryer thingy did what it had to do um if i were to rate this i'll probably give it i think about eight out of ten but maybe that's partially my fault because i didn't take my time with it but i wasn't trying to take my time with it but it did what it had to do it blow dried it blowed out um and yeah the only thing about this brush is that like if you have not seen your hair as you guys can see like i had a lot of knots because i didn't brush it out and my hair is growing so the the parts that are breaking and you know shedding are like what's the word for it getting mixed in with my hair that's still on my head i don't know um so sometimes i did have to like use my hand to like pull it out because obviously like the brick the bristles like they're strong but they're not like ragtail like are they no they're not like ragtail strong you know um so i did really like it loved it saved me a lot of time i would say because if i were going to do this if i was going to do this with like my own hands like air dry my hair use a normal brush or even a regular blow, blow dryer <clears throat> excuse me a regular blow dryer it would have taken me a bit longer but i do recommend this i'm gonna leave in the description box below the link Come on now, we're done. Stop trying to get into my hair. I'm gonna leave the link to this in the description box below. So if you guys are interested in trying this as well, um, I really wanna know what you guys think about this. Have you guys ever tried to use a brush like this? And if not, would you? And when you do, definitely let me know what you think. But yep. Yeah. so this is the end of this video. So definitely let me know if you guys wanna see more hair videos like this. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Do that right now, yes girl. Um, and yeah, thank you guys for watching as always, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.